Good evening fellow sim racers, how are you? Sorry if that was a bit loud. Let's put this down here. Out of the way. Right. Hello, hello. We're back again. We're doing a bit of racing on ACC. Uh, we've got an, uh, a Monza race to kick off. Um, in a moment. Just a second. Let me get my chat up. Just in case someone talks to me. Give me a minute. Lovely evening out there, nice and clear. Hopefully a nice day tomorrow. So, 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 right. Okay. So, let's kick off by launching ACC. It seems bright in here today. What's going on with the camera? Um, okay, we're streaming. So, let's get ACC on. I've just got a couple of things I need to do before we can race. Right, I need to check my controls because wiper, no pit limiter, flasher, camera, ignition starter. Okay, I think everything's right. I didn't think the wiper was... I didn't think the wiper was mapped to that button though. Why would that be the wiper? More likely to have... Um, to have to change the lights though. So, we've got a few minutes, uh, not really enough time to have any real fun, but regardless, let's just check our setups and whatnot, make sure we're ready. I'm not using that livery. <laughs> uh, what one am I using? Um, I've been using the this one here, All right? Should we use that? Fancy. Hello, Dista. How are you, mate? Nice to see you. Uh, I've just been here sitting here talking to myself for a few minutes. <laughs> um, yeah, I've been mess messing around with my feedback, force feedback settings, and whatnot. Um, But some just trying to pick a livery before we go and race. Uh, 
Yeah, we'll use this one. That'll do. Use the Jag. Jag. Jeremy Clarkson was such a legend. I still can't believe they fired them free from Top Gear. Still, to this day, blows my mind. Jag. I'm a. Uh, I'm registered with the Audi, so I can't change it now. We're doing um Oh, there's Jeff, look. We're doing a LFM race in a few minutes on Monza. So that's going to be uh, an, ex an experience. <laughs> uh, okay, I've got a setup here. Not much point going on track really, but I'm going to do it anyway. How are you anyway, man? Are you, uh, what have you been up to in uh, your sim racing life? Have you still been racing the MX-5 on uh, Assetto? I'm not too familiar with... Uh, this week is um, Hockenheim, isn't it? Not a track I'm too familiar with, so I'm a bit, uh, a bit unsure about with that race in there. Yeah, it's good crap. I missed out on Spa last week, which was uh, I was a bit gutted about actually. Hockenheim, yeah. I'm not, uh, yeah, I don't really know that track very well, but it looks fun. Maybe it's something I'll um, have a go at tomorrow. Yeah, it does look fun, yeah. I remember racing on Hockenheim. Uh, I'm sure it was on one of the old F1 games, but it's probably very different now. Yellow flag, yellow flag, be careful, <laughs> uh, right. Anyway, our race is starting, so let's get out of here. Um, you've also got LMP2 GT4 at Sebring this week. Um, the Sports Car Championship is racing at Daytona, I want to say. Um, you've got touring cars at Brands Hatch, that's classic combo. Uh, I wonder which sir. Uh, I hope we're in split two or three. I don't want to be in split one. No, 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 no. No split one shenanigans tonight, please. <sighs> Try again. Right, there's six splits, so we're going to be in one of the middle ones. Hopefully split three. We might have a chance. Um... No, no, not split three. Maybe split four. If we're not in split four, we'll be in split two. Oh. Yeah, the pace at Monza this week has been... Well, it looks absolutely fierce. Uh, people were just too experienced here, man. 14 degrees. Right, let's start with this. Fourteen degrees.
Hmm. Well, let's start with that and we'll go from there I suppose. I, re I really should look up a uh, setup for this track. I'm not reducing the wing any more than that. Do we know anyone in our split so far? No. Nope. That's a shame. I do like it when you end up with people you know in the same split. Anyway, well let's get out of there. Get stuck in. Let's get stuck in. We are door number 10 in split 2, so what does that mean? It means we might have a good outcome if we can qualify well. I'm looking at a top 10 hopefully. Car's been good. It's always a good start. Those right hand tyres are freezing cold. What can we do about that? Are we going to do the pause? We don't really need to do the pause, do we? No one in front of us, mate. Go. Go. Oh, those right-hand side tyres are absolutely freezing. Might have to do um, something about that. Not really sure what. Let's go. Let's bank one and then we haven't got to worry too much. If we can get a, a mid 48, maybe better. Not the best exit from the chicane. Yeah, I was so tempted to do uh, the Nordschleife race instead at 8 o'clock, but um, I just thought, you know, you've got to race Monza on LFM when it comes around. It doesn't happen too often. And that, um, yeah, oh no! <laughs> I was just distracted for a second. 48 too as well. What are you not to? <laughs> what was I saying? Um, I 
Sorry, I can do 48s all day here. Yeah, I was saying that um, hour long race at the Nordschleife is brutal. It's such hard work. Um, that's basically the only race that I can do if I do a race there. It's just such hard work. Come on, Mecca, pick up the pace. Let's go. Nice. The car in front is P6, and we basically matched his lap last time around. So, so that's what I'm looking for here. P top ten, quality. He looks pretty quick. Car 26. Wow. Looks like a good lap. 47.6. Take that. Have we got any more in us? I don't know. Damn, two temps up and the Mac is blocking us. It's going to slow us down. Uh, we've gone off. I knew that was happening. I could have to feel the understeer coming. Right. So we know we've got some time in us. We've got at least three temps in the first sector. I'll try and create some space for the next lap. After all that, we're still two temps up. So we've got at least half a second in us. Right, there's two temps. Knocks us up to P3. I wonder if we could be on pole if we did the perfect lap. Not as good of a start as the last lap. That's a shame. Balls it up. Oh no, no! I fucking fucked it! <laughs> They're bloody Audi, man. Audi things. Oh, 
Right, let's go again. With two and a half temps off of P1. Hi Dave, how are you man? How are you? Thanks for checking in again. Have you had a go at Air Monza this week yet? Yeah. <laughs> oh man, I can't get enough of it. Every time I try to stop using it, I come back to it. I think it's the sound. Certainly not the handling. I'm sure I've got pole in me here, but I'm struggling to tie the lap together. We're only two tenths off pole. Oh, okay, fair enough. Well, in that case, at least you're only missing out on Monza. Come on. This top ten is fierce. Look at it. <laughs> Don't even talk about it. Hoping to avoid it. Ah, we just got a bit too sideways. Run out of fuel. <sighs> well, we'll never know now, man. We've run out of fuel. We run out of fuel. <laughs> I think we had it in us. I do. We were two. We were two. We were three temps up a couple of lamp, a couple of laps ago. We had three temps uh, in the first sector, um, and I lost it all towards the end of the lap. And uh, yeah, I just didn't, I wasn't able to replicate it again. It's a shame. But, it is what it is. It is what it is. We're contending. I'd like a top 10 finish. Oh, that's a long old wait time, man. We could have got another two laps in. Yeah, I think we might end up 10 for this rate. People are just smashing us. Car 19, where's that? So we've got 19, 4, 17 out on track. 17's above me already. 4 is number f is P3. 19 is currently P10. So a car 19 could knock us down a spot. Here he comes across the line. He's done it. Yeah, he did it. Car 19 managed to put himself up on fourth place. Mr. Cruton, well done. Uh, car 17. None of the cars left on track have got enough time left for a valid lap. So P8 start. We could have been up here. We could have been up here. We certainly could have been P4. Oh well, we're above our door number, so. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I think we've all been there, mate. Um, I think that's quite, um, yeah, that's quite normal. Yeah, exactly. That is the challenge of it. It's one of those things where you never know. You're breaking, you break away in Scotland. It could be the thing that that um, allows you to progress. It's it's a really strange phenomenon. I think. Um, yeah, it's a weird one. And I, why do we overdrive? It's like the, we know it's the wrong thing to do.
Yeah, we do all go through it. It's, it's such a funny thing. I'm pretty. I'm think I'm there myself, to be honest, pace-wise. Um, I know I don't have alien talent in me. It's not, but it doesn't bother me at all. Um, I've always said I'd like to be like in within a hundred and five percent of the best times, and that's generally where I am or above. So, and um, yeah, a different car, do something different, mix it up. Uh, quite often sleeping. <laughs> I know it sounds funny, but I, I'm sure you thought it too. I'm pretty sure if you feel like you're hitting a wall and you just stop and then just go to bed, sleep on it, and come back a day later, you sort of, I'm sure I read something a while ago about how we learn in our sleep without, like, we sort of bank the information that we've learned that day, even if we don't know about it, like, our brain has banked it and so we learn while we're sleeping and you can come back the next day and suddenly just something clicks uh, I feel like I've not done something I feel like I've done something wrong Ooh. let's just get on with it yeah this is a fierce split fierce like there's so many close together drivers I know, at least I know I had a couple of temps in me, so we probably should have put a couple more clicks of tyre pressure in. It's going to get colder, I think. Going double fire. Yeah, I mean, I'd be happy with it, with that, mate. Hey, it's funny, isn't it? The MX-5 is a, one of those cars you really learn from driving. Cool, I'm really nervous for this one. I feel very uh, on edge. I can't believe you drove the Jag for two months. <laughs> Why would you do that to yourself? Okay, here we go. Green, green, green! Let's just go easy into turn one, we know what it's like. Car on the right. Clear on the right. Yeah, everyone easy. Car on the right. Clear on the right. Good start. I'll catch up with the chat in a minute, boys. There's been some yellow flags, I believe. Looks like there's been an incident. <laughs> you know, you know. Come on, come on, go, go, go. Stop messing around. They really held me up through there. Come on. Yeah, the MX-5 teaches you loads. It really is a great car to uh, muck around in.
This pink flower is holding us up, I reckon. Damn, that's gonna cost me a place. Silly mistake. I knew that was going to happen. <gasps> no, 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 no! Oh, I'm so sorry, so sorry. I'm going to let them through. That Porsche just wrecked me, man. That Porsche just wrecked me hard. You fucking imbecile. Sorry, boys. That's not what we want to see, is it? The Porsche just took me out. What a dickhead. What was he doing? <sighs> Can't drive it back. What was he doing? Absolute twat. Why would you do that there? That's completely on the Porsche, what a dick. Car 25. What an absolute tool. Yeah, yeah we'll go out again. Fuck me, four minutes of time, Jesus Christ. I'm going to send him a message right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty livid. <laughs> you know it, man. When you're, when you're starting in the top ten and that shit happens, nah. Yeah, I'm pissed. I'm going to send him a message. Car 25. Kai Amler, German. Why can't I message him? He won't even let me message him. Absolute child. Yeah, it's too late, I've missed him. I just said, what's wrong with you? Twat. Hopefully we'll take on his dinner. <sighs> Should we have a look at what happened? I hope that doesn't reset my uh, timer. He's just pushed me over into the barrier. DN Animation, hello again mate, how are you? You've caught us at a bad time. <laughs> He's literally just hit me into the barrier. The guy should have been backing off here at this point. He should have been backing off instead of trying to barge his way through. This is a Assetto Corsa Competizione. 
a racing game uh, from a few years back. Weird. I mean, I've seen weirder things, but yeah, I know what you mean. Oh my goodness, the guy, Kai Amler, is said in the chat, what, WTF? He's got a cheek, hasn't he? Yeah, I mean, pfft. it's not good, is it? It's just... It's the fact he's got the cheek to comment as well in, in, on the... Uh, He's got the cheek to comment in the chat. And uh, yeah, hi Jason anyway, by the way, sorry. And Ace, hi, how are you? Welcome, welcome. You've chosen a tumultuous time to join in the stream, but uh, welcome anyway. Oh, I'll definitely report him. And I'll report him for, for swearing in the chat as well. He's got the cheek to say WTF in the chat. <laughs> Just rammed me into a barrier, you nut to. Yeah. I've messaged him on um, LFM. Let's see if he replies to me. What a waste of uh, 45 minutes. <laughs> Nothing to salvage from this, is there? We were a lap down from the car in front. We've had that long in the pits. Anyway, boys, let's go for a drive. Look forward to the next one, eh? Yellow flag in three. Ace, hi, I've not seen you in here before. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Or uh, Jason Brooks, that name doesn't ring a bell either. So, hello to you guys. Yep, yeah, we've just got taken out by a Porsche. We qualified P8 and we're now 26. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> exactly Dave, yeah exactly. Oh, okay. Nice to have you along. It's frustrating when things like this happen, they don't go away, but yeah, we've got to try and take something positive from it. We qualified high, so that's a positive. We had a good race start, I think. We were quite tidy through lap one. Uh, I think the sort of catalyst for that incident really was I did contact that uh, McLaren. And that sort of set the whole thing off. <laughs> yeah, I really like how it sounds. Well, that was messy. Yeah, I had, um, going back to what Jason said about iRacing, uh, about a month ago, or maybe a bit longer, I took uh, nearly two weeks off of LFM because I just got so fed up with the driving standards. And I just said, sod it, I'm not using it for a while. I, I, I think really I had, no, I had no intention of going back to LFM, but... Eventually I came back.
<laughs> Game over. Yeah, nice one, Dean. <laughs> Appropriate emoji. We're going to have another go at the next one. ACC is excellent. Um, I do race and I racing as well. I like both equally to be honest. Uh, ACC maybe edges it for me. I've got a lot more time in ACC and not much time in I racing. But yeah, I really enjoy I racing. I think it's the variety is what does it for me. And if you're not on LFM yet, get on it. It's uh, you know, the, the driving standards are sort of hit and miss at the moment, but... Yeah, exactly. That's exactly it, Dave. I was having this conversation a few days ago with someone else. Like, what was the, what was the license test for Nordschleife? It was about... Hold on. Was it two clean laps or something? Under 8.38? It's like, come on. And then, yeah, the, um, the license tests are far too easy. It's like one, I think people had to get a 137 average, a high 137 average on Mizano to qualify for their license. And yet when you join LFM, you've got people in the lowest splits doing 34s, 35s. And I think to do, um, to get your Nordschleife license, you should have to do at least eight laps under one for, uh, 830. Cheers, Dean, appreciate that. I do appreciate the likes, they get people's eyes on the stream, don't it? doesn't it? That's right, yeah, you need um, ATSA, yeah. But, um... Yeah, Jason, if you want to build up your SA, if you look on uh, YouTube for my friend uh, Jeff TSC, TSC stands for the Sim Cafe, um, we do community racing uh, twice a week or even three times a week. Uh, really friendly people, uh, well, we welcome new people and your, your SA will be up there in no time. Cheers Ace, I appreciate that. Really appreciate it. Your, your SA will build up in no time if you're racing people online. It's just one of them things you have to do it like fairly consistently and try and stay as clean as you can. Yeah, it'll be there before you know it. I'll send you, um, oh, I don't know if I, how can I send you a link? On YouTube, search for uh, Jeff TSC. He has his uh, channel. And on his profile, or on one of his streams, you'll find a link to uh, his Discord. If you've got Discord. 
uh, they tend to do community races with like yeah a good group of people like normally 30 plus people in these races and um, yeah just come along and race with us they're just fun races it's nothing serious Yeah, I mean that is it, you just have to stay close to them, don't you? A lot of people think you need to race, but you don't, you just just stay within yeah, half a second of them. I'm being blue flags for the car behind, but I'm quicker, so... I think I'm allowed to unlap myself if I'm quicker, aren't I? I don't so. Yeah, way more fun to come and race with us on TSC. Okay, yeah, we're not last anymore, we're 25th now. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. If I if I can see he's quicker than me, I'd let him pass, but I'm definitely faster. Right, all the cars in front of me are a lap ahead, so there's really there's not much point in uh oh no, the twenty fourth is actually on the same lap as me, so we can overtake him. Yeah, I'll tell you what, when this um, when this race finishes I'll post a link. Have you got Discord? Yeah, that's pretty much it, isn't it? I'll try and be predictable. Okay, yeah, if you've got this called, you're all set. I'll send you the link. Um, say hello in there, the um, ACC section of the Discord and uh, yeah loads of people will welcome you in. It's a really friendly group. And I don't get any discounts or any it's not an affiliation thing. Jeff won't give me anything for recommending you. It's purely just because I think they're uh, nice people and we all have a laugh racing together. And it's probably cleaner than uh, LFM most of the time. But I mean, that's the benefit of racing with people that you talk to uh, online every day, I suppose. You're a bit more careful about how you drive. We are cutting into Pavon in front. I don't think we'll catch him for the end of the race. There's only a couple of laps left.
Oh, uh, cool. How come you can't work, man? I haven't got enough time to race these days with my little one. She, uh, yeah, if I'm not working, I'm with my daughter. And then when she's in bed, that's my time to shine. <laughs> Here we go, last two laps. Faster car behind you. Yellow flag in sector three. We're within two and a half seconds of him. Just got to chip away. Might be able to salvage one more position. Ah, oh, sorry to hear that, mate. Sorry to hear that. Hopefully, um, you'll have no more problems in that area. I can't imagine sim racing is um, much good for your heart. <laughs> he's off again. He's he's uh, basically inviting me through. Come here, Pavon. Come on. <laughs> I love that way of thinking about it, it's so true. Nobody wants to die, but we've all got to... Let's go, come on. Make one more mistake and I'll have you. Everyone's having to go at P20. Not even on the same lap. <laughs> if P20 could hold him up for me, that would be brilliant. Oh, I'm going to lose so much elo from this race. <laughs> He's, he's held it together. Fair play to him. I thought he might feel a bit of pressure at the end, but... I thought he might feel a bit of pressure, but he didn't. He said sorry, Kai Amler. Is he serious? Oh, no. No, no, no. I need that replay. Save it. Let them fight. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, the guy said sorry in the chat. I don't think that's really going to cut it. Nope, I don't think that's going to cut it. Right, let's get registered for the next race. We've got some making up to do. Redemption. Um, next one. Ten minutes away. Straight into the next one. Come on. Don't worry about ELO and safety ratings and all that. I don't think you guys can see my desktop, can you? 
Um, how do I make it so you can see my desktop? Maybe. Uh, maybe if I move this one over the top of that one, does that work? Oh yeah, the link. Yep, 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 yep. Good shout, mate. No worries. Where's my phone? So. Um, I'll send you that link right now. I'll put it in the chat. They're a really good bunch, honestly. Jeff's really uh, friendly. Um, and this goes for anyone in the chat. Anyone who's, if you're interested in just a friendly bunch of people that race every week. Um, on ACC uh, feel free to click on this link and uh, join the discord the discord the sim cafe has nothing to do with me it's not my group it's not my thing it's Jeff's but uh, I just really yeah I really like what they're doing what he's doing here we go All right I've put it in the uh, chat now hopefully you can click on that there we go so uh, yeah Dave Dave you should join as well um, I want to say thank you to Ace High for subscribing and liking the stream really appreciate that man uh, you do a bit of eye racing, don't you, uh, Ace Hyde? You do. You've never tried ACC. Highly recommend it. I mean, if you're into your GT racing, uh, yeah, eye racing is enjoyable as well. Don't get me wrong. I like. I really enjoy the GT fours in eye racing, but um, obviously ACC. It's sort of like the the specialist thing that it does. Right. Yeah, join Dave, honestly man. We have really it's not like it's not like LFM where everyone's uh, overly aggressive and feisty and you know what I mean? It's not, no one's like no one's pulling skin off each other. But there's there's like someone everyone's got a good couple of people to race. There's a few people that match each other's level regardless of what track we're on. And uh, yeah, the top guys have got really decent pace. Um, if you have a little, just have a little nose at one of Jeff's streams and you'll get a feel for what it's like, you know. Yeah, why not, man? It's good to have a break from things. Yeah, I tend to just hop in, hop between them. But yeah, I can definitely see how you could get burnt out on doing one. How do you? Um, just interested in hearing your thoughts on. Uh, if you do GT threes in uh, I racing, how do you feel they compare to ACC? So far, I've managed to try the Audi and the two nine six. but only for a few laps each, really. When um, you know, when they've been doing maintenance.
Ooh, break's a bit late. Yeah, I think they've both got their strong points and their weaknesses. Yeah. <laughs> yes, Let's see once you've got to grips with it. I don't think... Um, I don't know why one's got to be better than the other, they're just different, you know. The braking's a lot harder on iRacing. And the things that iRacing does well, ACC doesn't do so well. And the things ACC does well, iRacing isn't as good. I'm gonna let this guy through. I was trying to let him through, and he just sort of wants to tail me. Yeah, yeah, we all know about the cost, don't we? I feel like if the content was like half the price, it would be a lot more reasonable. It's, it's hard to swallow £15 for one track every time you want to race for a week. I really enjoy those uh, Formula Ford 1600s, they're good fun. They swap ends like more often than not, don't they? You do one, one little thing wrong in those cars and they tell you about it. Oh, well, after the currency conversion. Yeah, it is what it is. At least, um, compared to our factor, at least it, the content is sort of worth the money because there's people to race. The problem with our factor is you spend a fortune on content. I don't know why I'm bringing our factor up, sorry. But you can spend a fortune on content for our factor and then there's hardly anyone using it. What's the time? Right, we've got three minutes. Three minutes till the next race. We've got some making up to do. Oh, stay off that curb. Ah, so it sort of gave you something to look forward to, something to aim for. Yeah, sim racing can mean a lot of things to a lot of people. I think it's really beneficial to like uh, mental health and even physical health really. Well, well done you mate, you go out of hospital, you treated yourself and you're embracing it, making the most of it. Just don't let it put you back in the hospital.
Yeah, it's not it's not a cheap hobby, is it? It's painful in that way. And there's always something new you want, something you want to upgrade or just replace or something breaking. It's definitely not a cheap hobby. Oh nice. Nice, nice, nice. I wish I could have budget budgeted for Assetek or even Simagic. I'm happy with my Mosa stuff, but yeah, Assetek is that next step up. Yeah, Money well spent. If it makes you happy, it's well spent. That's it. Don't let anyone tell you different. Yeah, another two screens would be nice, wouldn't it? I'm thinking about it. I, I keep edging myself towards it. Alright. Uh, if I want another two screens, I'll need a monitor mount. And then that's just another thing. What size is it? Maybe could you get another two of the same screen quite easily? Uh, oh, I wonder what split we're in. I just realised my phone's still on. What's, what split are we in? Let's have a quick little look. Split two again. Let's hope this split's a lot more friendly to us. I don't want to be racing the same guy. Can't remember his name now. Let's start with this one. So 20, 20 litres ran out at last quality, didn't it? So we'll take... Um, we, we would have been able to do another lap. 43 OLED and a 50 out the back that I did have. Oh, okay. I mean, if, if you could get two more 43s... They're expensive though, aren't they, the 43s? I think most people go with triple 32s. Um, I'm guessing your roller is 4K. So if you can get a, a triple 32 inch setup that are like 1440s, and if you can push those at 120 hertz, you'll, you'll be having a great time. <laughs> That's my ultimate goal, I think. XP1 Pro, what's that? Fill me in on that please. I'm not sure what that is. It sounds like a cockpit. Uh, right, Jay Sullivan's in our split. Nice one, Jay. I think that's the RJ. Uh, Jay Sullivan's one of the people we race with in um, the Sim Cafe.
Thank you, thank you, guy. Oh, nice, okay. Yeah, that would be lovely, mate. You'll love that. And 60 hertz is more achievable, anyway. Hello Cranky, nice to see you man, I haven't seen you in chat for a while. Well I think I saw you actually last week didn't I? I hope you're well dude. We had a bit of a crappy last race so we're trying to make up for it this one. a little excursion. Are we going to catch up with him? I don't want to catch up. Just in case we're too quick. The beamer looks a bit unpredictable. Oh, okay. A business trip. Very official. Did you go anywhere nice, Cranky? Anywhere scenic? Oh, that's a bit cheeky actually, isn't it? You do have to look out for that sort of thing. I've noticed that with TVs. We recently bought a new TV and it was like a minefield of just finding out what actually could do what and you know what I mean, like you have to really look at the specs. Whoa! Held that together just about. Yeah, this, this BMW looks a bit like a uh, bit of a liability. Yeah, and I bet it wasn't cheap either. Let us through, let us through. Three times he went off in one lap. Yeah, I bet that wasn't cheap. slowed it down a bit too much there Basel, very nice mate I've been to Munich, with Munich um, I've been to Munich twice actually Yeah, 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 yeah. Especially Basel, yeah. I used to work with a lady from there and she said it was just, she didn't want to go back because of how expensive it was. And we lived in London at the time. <laughs> Which is not exactly cheap itself. In fact, I think she still lives in South London in a very expensive uh, terraced house. I went to Munich um, a couple years ago, went to do a road trip around Bavaria uh, in November. Very nice time of the year to visit. Very snowy, 
sunny but snowy lovely and fresh weather to walk around in I hope you're going to let me through buddy thank you Oh, come on, we can do better than this. Come on. <laughs> okay, mate. Thank you for coming in. It's been nice talking to you. Definitely do that. Oh, no, I've missed that. I've missed the breaking point. That's my fault for talking. Yeah, that is mad, isn't it? It's a lot of money. It's no joke. The juice must be worth the squeeze though, right? <laughs> I hope so. Come on, we've got a bit of time in us, I'm sure we have. Mate, I can do 47s all day at Monza. <laughs> Relax, we'll get there. I've just been talking, I've been distracted. I did a 47.5 earlier. Oh yeah, I bet they do, mate. I bet they do. I love Bavaria. I really want to go back. I don't know if I've asked you, Cranky, where you live, if you don't mind saying. Are you in the UK? Welcome to the stream boys, keep it down please, I'm concentrating. No talking too loud. Right, head down for a minute, okay? Try and get a good lap. <laughs> oh, you're in West Germany. No, read this. <laughs> oh, no. Ah, I messed up the last turn. Fifth. Overhausen. Audi power! Come on V10. Let's show these boys what we've got.
lost a bit of time there. Come on. Come on. I'm going to look it up on uh, Google Maps afterwards. I'd love to go back to Germany. Okay, there's a couple of temps. Sort of ish. B2. Come on. Have we got enough fuel? Oh, we've messed up T1. That'll do. P3 so far. Wow, I've got someone in Texas, someone in Oberhausen, someone in the Netherlands. Probably got a bunch of people in the UK. Oh, Freddy goes travelling for business. Wow. You guys. Jay Sullivan up in PA. Nice one, Jay. Yeah, this is LFM. Yeah, we're in split two of LFM Monza. Second race of the night. The the first race was an absolute um, horror show. Well, no, it wasn't. It wasn't. No. We had a fantastic start to the first race. A uh, really good first lap. And then, yeah, it went downhill in the second lap. We got destroyed by a Porsche who sent us into the barrier. Yeah, the less said about that, the better. I, w I wish I had a job that uh, entailed travelling for work. It would be really nice. No need for business trips in my line of work. All my exes live in Texas. Is that a line from a song? <laughs> That's got to be a line from a song, isn't it? I'm sure it is. I recognise it. Uh, right. P1 flying. Look at that. I've never been to, I've never been anywhere in Switzerland. Mm hmm, an IT consultant, eh? Very nice line of work. <laughs> I can't name the song, it's not coming to me, but I know, I know the line. Uh, okay, I wasn't concentrating at all during quali. Uh, one, two, three. I know they were a bit high. Did anyone see anything <laughs> useful? <laughs> Oh, it doesn't matter really, does it? We, we're we're going to probably get smashed into on that too or something. Yeah. Oh, I bet, mate. I can imagine. I can imagine. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be in a different hotel every week. If I want to be fair, if I wanted a job like that, I could get a job like that. I like sleeping in my own bed, coming home to my daughter every night, or every day even. And uh, yeah, it's a, it's a lot of work and a lot of stress, traveling for work. A lot of responsibility, probably targets to meet. Yeah. It's not for everyone. 
Uh, where did we end up? P5. Okay. 20 seconds. But at least you've got the option, Freddy. Because, you know, you, you're lucky you had that option open to you that you could stop travelling so much. Um, and it's going to be... You're going to really appreciate that once your daughter comes. Yeah, yeah. It was an ugly incident. The thing is, the Porsche was just trying to butt his way through where he had no space. Uh, and he had the cheek to write in the chat, uh, WTF. Anyway, I don't want to dwell on it. I don't want to dwell on it. It's probably one of those things where if you think about it too much, you'll manifest it again. It'll happen again. <laughs> I messaged the guy. Hopefully, he'll say sorry. Go. Green line, green line. Go. Cheers, Freddy. Let's see what happens. I'm going to concentrate for the first couple of laps. Let's try and get our heads down, concentrate. You'll forgive me if I don't talk for a minute or two. I'm trying to make up for the last race. I just want a clean race to be honest. Cheers boys. We've got Audi power, we don't need to worry. The Audi is so underrated. Well, these guys in front are pulling away for sure. They're quick. They're the quick boys. Yeah, the uh, McLaren behind is not, uh, sorry, the Ferrari behind, he's not giving up too easily, is he? There he is, he's got a run on me. I'm going to hold the inside. How's this going to go? Car on the left. Still alongside me.
Are you still there? He's still there. Why is he still there? I should have let him through. I'm scared. Bit of breathing room for a second. Yeah, it sounds like it sounds like you're doing quite well for yourself, Frankie, man. That's definitely not something to uh, to begrudge or turn your nose up at. Yeah, there, there is like uh, there's so many facets to life, and work and success in that area is just one of them. But yeah, as you say, opportunities. They without money, you can't have opportunities, you know. So. <laughs> Swings and roundabouts, as we say in this country. Don't know if that's the phrase where you are, but yeah. Swings and roundabouts. You pay your money, you take your choice. And there'll be pros and cons. I hope I've taken enough fuel. It's just occurred to me that it might not be enough. Oh, that's a bit too much curve. Don't do that again. Right, if we can push a bit, we might be able to catch up with um, P3, Mr. Chicken. A P3 would be nice, wouldn't it? A podium. Can we do it? What sort of time are they doing? Okay, we lap two temps faster than P3. Keep on his case. We've seen many times before people make mistakes from nowhere. They don't need pressure on them to make mistakes. I think we'll be fine for fuel, looking at the time and the amount of laps we've got.
47 47.7 47.3 from chicken that's the signing How do people do 45s? Like seriously. Uh, Cranky, if you're still there, I remember you were talking about, um, you were sort of preparing to buy your own sim equipment and get stuck into the hobby. Is that something you're any closer to doing or is it just sort of on the back burner for the moment? That's such an American phrase, isn't it? Back burner. Someone's off. Oh, that distracted me. <laughs> Who's off? I don't know who was that kicking up dust. Chicken's having a go at P2. If they battle away, uh, that'll slow them both down and we can have a little look in. Get our nose stuck in there. Go on boys, you keep fighting. Come here. Come here, I'm going to nip at your heels. Come on. Come here, chicken. Oh, oh, he's off. Chicken's off. What's your rejoin? Oh, he's he's just stopped. Chicken stopped. Maybe he chickened out. Forgive me for that one. P3 boys. Let's bring it home. Podium would be nice, wouldn't it? All we need to do is keep Pereja behind us. Oh, hold on a minute. I'll read that when I get to a straight bit. <laughs> I don't want to jeopardize this race. Oh nice, very nice mate, not too far off then.
Yeah, pace is okay, but the car behind is definitely picking it up a bit. Ooh. I need him to make some mistakes, really. Oh no, that's that's us making a mistake. That's definitely not the quickest way through that corner. Triple screens, man. Everyone's got triple screens. I really want triple screens. Should I just do it? Bit of brake fade. I know it's a long old, long old, uh, long old race to go. If I can keep him about one and a half, two seconds away. I'll be quite content with that. We need to maintain this pace. I mean, this is bloody quick pace for me, to be honest. 47s. I'm more of a 48s sort of man. You know what I mean? I'm not really sure how I'm doing it, to be honest. Meanwhile, he's taken half a second out of us. To the death. <laughs> he is really chipping away at us. I don't know if you can see that, but he's up down to eight tenths. Yeah, well this is the thing, isn't it? This thing. The GPUs are just uh, pushed to the max. But yeah, it's, a, it's, it's an awesome sight having the triple set up, especially 32s or bigger. have you getting stuck in with us mate it'll be really good to have you on track <laughs> the money well spent man you can't take it with you Seven point five car behind forty seven point eight. Okay, that's positive. At least you're still playing on triples. Get on the track. Nearly made a mistake.
Total. Wow, that's gonna it'll come around quick, mate. That's gonna go so fast. And uh, then it'll be summer and no one will be racing. <laughs> All you need to do, mate, is just hammer out the laps. Just get as much time in the seat as you can, practice. And uh, yeah, you know, everyone likes having you around. So you're not gonna be short of people to race with and places to race. Oh, he's within seven temps now, Pareja. Let's go. Head down. Oh, we've overcooked it. Oh, no. Scrappy, very scrappy. Ooh. Two temps lost into the chicane. I'm driving in my mirror too much. I've got to stop looking in the mirror. Stop looking at his delta. Pressure's getting to me a bit. Oh, there he is. There he is. He's right with us. I don't even know if I've got enough fuel. Oh, the Audi lost some traction into the last turn. Yeah, see, it's going to get us. Fair play to him there in the braking zone. It's good driving. I thought I could undercut him, but I couldn't. Now, what can we do? Can we force him to make a mistake? forced ourselves into a mistake. Ah, he's away. We made a couple of mistakes there and that's it. Yeah, I mean we're comfortably in fourth. I'll keep on him but I can't see us getting it back. Ah well, I tried. He's quick, he's just a bit too quick. Freddy's the nice guy of ACC. <laughs> yeah, I don't think there's anyone he wouldn't help out. Yeah, I mean that goes for me as well mate, honestly. I'm no guru, I'm no alien, but uh, yeah. I'm quite good at Brown's Hatch. If you want help with Brown's Hatch. <laughs> Ah, he's away, look at him. He's got all of his confidence back from earlier in the race. 
fair play to him for the overtake. Kept it clean. He braked later, he took the position. P4 is a solid finish. That's a solid finish in split two. I'm quite happy with that. Oh yeah, you've made legend. Freddie, you're a legend, man. Don't take that the wrong way, what I said. I mean, when I say the nice guy of ACC, I mean that as a compliment. You're always offering to help people. Always so super friendly. Nice one, mate. Take care, Freddy. I'll see you next time. Hopefully, you'll be streaming this week, and I'll see you again. <sighs> Well, P4, Jay Sullivan finished in P8. Yeah, have a good night, Freddie, mate. Look after yourself. And uh, thanks for checking in, always. Uh, right. Cheers Cranky, yeah, not a bad race mate, not bad. I'm not going to turn my nose up at P4. We nearly had P3, didn't we? We were that, that close. He got us just in time. Uh, right, I, I'm not going to do another race. Um, I want to do some laps of uh, the Nordschleife. Because I was a bit too tired to do the hour long race here tonight. Um, but I wanted to have a go all the same. Just get a couple of laps in. It keeps you sharp, it keeps you sharp, you know, for next time you need to race there. Um, I've been knocking on the door of two, of 820s. Pardon me, sorry about that. Um, I sort of, our best time last week was an 819. Which I was, I was absolutely um, astonished by that we got an 819. Um, I've been testing this setup here. So, yeah, I was just absolutely astonished that we got an 819, but I haven't been able to replicate it. Uh, yesterday I managed an 822. Um, or was it? No, I think it was an 821 in the Audi. And then, this is the thing about um, the Ferrari 296, right? 854 on controller isn't bad, mate. This is not an easy game to play on controller. I don't envy you at all. Uh, it's difficult with a controller because it's so sensitive. I, I, I take my hat off to you for doing it with a controller at all. It's a great track, isn't it? It's an amazing track, and they've done a brilliant job of it. Um, so yeah, yesterday, the joke of the 296 is, I literally, I, I took the Audi out, I did an 821 after a few laps. Bear in mind I've got about, probably 500 hours in the Audi. Swapped over to the 296, did two laps, And on the second lap, I did an 821, the same as my Audi time. Uh, and yeah, it's just such a, it's a really fun car to drive, really fun and responsive. It just goes where you point it. Uh, but it is one of those cars, it's really forgiving of your mistakes, you know? Little drift. 
Um, yeah, it's really, really forgiving. Whereas the Audi will bite you. It will, it will actually punish you for any sort of serious mistake. Or if you hit the wrong curb the wrong way. No one's coming, are they? No. Yeah, try the 296, honestly. There's a reason it's so popular. And it's, it's not just because it's fast. It's because it's a bit of a... I don't want to say cheat car, but I don't want to offend anyone. But it was quite easy to extract that time out of it. Oh, hello. Bit of oversteer. The track feels a bit greasy actually. I love the Audi, but I do wonder if I'm just punishing myself more than I need to. Um, <laughs> I started playing ACC with the Aston Martin a couple of years ago. Uh, such an easier car to drive as well. That's more like a, a boat. It's just so stable. Anyway, we're about to go onto the track. Oh, that's no way to join the track, is it? Way, hey, <laughs> calm down. Wow, the Audi's getting a bit sideways. Okay, here we go. Crappy start to the lap. Hey, Juan, nice to see you, mate. Hello. Hold on a minute. Yeah, I was literally just singing the Audi's praises. It's, it's like you heard me. Well, I was talking about the 296, really. Best car 992. <laughs> the 992 is wild. Oh, oh, oh! Wow! Wow, wow, wow. Been caught out there. Wait, how much damage have we got? Oh, quite a lot. Should we just carry on? We'll carry on. Wow, it's quite unusual to get caught out there. I think I was still laughing about the 992. Right, you guys didn't see that, okay? I never make mistakes here. Couldn't make it up, could you? <laughs> oh, whoa! Okay, okay. 
Now we're going back to the pit. <laughs> oh no, I'm on the track. <sighs> Something feels off in the setup. And I'm not just saying that, I'm not making excuses. It feels a bit um a bit unruly. Oh what could it be? It's a bit oversteery. Tracks optimum. Oh here we go. Look at the ride heights. This setup is this is a junk setup. This is not um I don't know why I loaded this setup. It's completely wrong. The ride heights were all uh <laughs> I've just stopped talking. I'll stop talking. Uh, we could probably do with an extra click of wing actually. Change the car. No! No! No, 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 no. We're gonna get, we're gonna smash our lap record today. I'm telling you now. Hello, Audi. <laughs> Hello, Audi. To be fair, it was not set up right. There was something odd with that set up and I knew it. It feels better already. You watch, you watch. 2.19 coming up, 2.19. Oh, it feels so much better. <laughs> Hello Riley, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. You're just in time for some torture, some self-flagellation. That's not, that's not what, is that what I think it is? Self-deprecation maybe? <laughs> it feels better already, honestly it does. Should we do the joker lap? Should we do it properly? I personally, I think you're just jealous that you can't drive the Audi. I think that's what it is. You wish you could because it sounds so good. Oh, it feels great now. It genuinely does feel better. You don't believe me. I know you won't believe me, but it does. Auto asphyxiation. <laughs> well, that's that's my favourite type of asphyxi asphyxiation. <laughs> oh, come on, serious business now. Wait, did I break too early then? Doesn't matter. Come on, get on with it. Jeff, have you been streaming tonight, Jeff? <laughs> it, it's no 992 but it does the job <laughs> loyal to a fault you watch you watch just watch I'm telling you, it, the ride height was just completely ruining it. It was screwed it up. Oh. You, you saw that, yeah? <laughs> I'm going to pretend no one saw that. No, it, it still handles like um, a soggy sausage in a bathtub. Let's get on with it, come on. You'll see. Oh, before it was an oversteering mess.
Uh, there was a guy in here earlier I was chatting to, Jeff, if you're still there. I uh, put him onto the Sim Cafe. I've been sending quite a few customers your way. I think it's time we discuss some commission arrangement. <laughs> uh, I think his name was Jason. I think it was Jason. Really nice fella. Um, he does eye racing, but he's getting into ACC. Bit of unsteer. Soggy sausage. <laughs> Yeah, a little bit of understeer. I prefer a little bit of understeer than oversteer. Let's ignore that red timer up in the top left corner. <laughs> You're just jealous. You wish you could do this in the Audi, don't you? Stick around boys, I'll show you my ways. You can do it too. Only the chosen ones can drive the Audi. Oh, hello. Can't park there mate. Yeah, I said it. Don't touch that curb. Get off the grass. Miss, miss, miss. No, 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 <laughs> we did that in the last lap, damn, we didn't hit anything did we, right, I won't do that again, I'll be there at Brown's Hatch mate, yeah I'm going to Brown's Hatch, I've cleared it with the missus, You have to remember, don't, I, I'm, I'm not going to make excuses, right? But I am going to make an excuse. I have done two races tonight, so I'm tired. I've done a full day of work. I looked after my daughter in the afternoon on my own. Um, I've done a bunch of other stuff. <laughs> Mate, I literally took... Um, the 296 out yesterday and, and uh, matched my PB. I didn't know there were murderous death bumps on the inside of that turn. On the grass, I mean. Uh. <laughs> uh, the Audi's been uh, finicky. Uh, to be fair, it's me. It's not the car. It's me. It's not the car. We didn't get any damage, so... It's a bit understeery now. I might have gone too far with the uh, the setup change. 
Jeff, do you know who's going to be at Brands Hatch? Just curious. Who else is going to meet up? Get off the grass, get off the grass. Yeah, what other excuses can we think of? Um, the sun's not really in the right place. It's, it's a bit tricky, actually. Uh, all the shadows are blocking the breaking points. Everyone, yeah. It sounds like, it, it does look like it's gonna be uh, quite popular. <laughs> Half a lap in the Shmaili with a four laps in the other car. I'll tell you that as a compliment, actually. On a, yeah, on a Saturday, at the, on our Nordschleife race, I went from 34 to 6. Which I was incredibly impressed with. Right, let's go again, come on. 8.19. Is there going to be a stream? Hey Jeff, are you going to live stream with your phone? Don't touch that. You donut. <laughs> I hope you're going to bring a, a variety of sweets for people to try. Or like weird stuff. So why don't you bring your cat? Bring your cat in a rucksack. Yes, 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 yes. Wait, um, I remember, um, I remember there was talk of uh, setting up a sim in the, the inside of Druids. Someone was going to set up a sim. And we were all just going to do laps of Brown's Hatch. I'm in the zone now. Simception. Or have like a, LA, a LAN party with ACC. That would be epic. A bunch of us bring our PCs along. Go, 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 go! Yeah, exactly. Absolutely epic. Get off the grass, get off the grass. 
how, ne how not to get 819. Right, watch out for the grass. It's better. They do actually, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I don't know how much it costs. Actually, last year they had um, a sim rig in a trailer for people to jump on. It looks quite popular as well. It's quite a cool thing to do if you've got a bunch of friends. If it's like a tenner ago, you get put into a raffle and you will see who can do the best time. It's good fun. But it's, it's hard to uh, justify it when you've got one at home. Oh no, we're going to hit the wall. Talking, I'm talking. You need to concentrate here. You need to concentrate. <laughs> so if we were to do an 819, we'd be there, P6. How many more laps have I got in me? I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'll be up for that. I play, I play hide and seek every day mate, so you're not going to beat me. Thank you, take care mate. Thanks for coming in and chatting. Always good catching up with you. See you later. Come on, 819, we can do it man, we can do it. I know we can. Whoa, big lag there. Yeah, so Cranky's gonna have his um, all of his sim gear in about a month or two. So he'll finally be able to start racing with all of us. I can't believe I've binned it three or four times, like, what is going on? Any other day I can just lap it without any issues at all. I'm just tired. Here we go again. Breaking too early there. Yeah, Jeff, are you doing Monza this week? Have you done Monza tonight? I bet I'm not the only one avoiding Kota. I hate that track.
eight people are watching just going, how does he do that with the Audi? How does he do it? Oh, oh no! Oh no! Get back on the track! How did you get on with Monza, mate? Oh, a really bad first race. Qualified really well in both races. Good second race, but the first one we got taken out by a Porsche. One of your brethren. I think I'll do Nords on Thursday as well, mate. I feel like Jeff has struck the right balance with two races, you know. Like I, I tend to get sloppy after that and tired. I think he's got the right idea. trouble man. The problem is they can't control their cars. Porch. Porsche. <laughs> have a word mate, have a word. And then, the thing is, the guy took me out, well he smashed me into a barrier at like 150 miles an hour. And uh, he had the cheek to put into the chat on LFM, WTF. And I was like, come on, really? Typical entitled Porsche attitude. Oh, oh, ho, ho, ho. She tried to get away from me. I don't think this setup's any good. I'll be honest. I'll be honest. Uh, I've got another setup I could try, but not tonight. Right, that's where we binned it last time. So we've got further this time. <laughs> okay, mate. Take care, man. I'll talk to you later. He doesn't like it when we talk badly about the Porsches. Understandable. Oh no, what's going on here? Is he going to let us through or? Traffic. I mean, if someone caught me up on this track, I'd just let them through, you know. I wouldn't even. Clear on the right. Clear on the right. 
fuck you now. Can't catch a break here, can we? Jordana in the McLaren, sort your life out, fella. Come on. You could have just let me through, couldn't you? And it basically an empty Nordschleifer. <laughs> yeah, you know what, he did remind me of someone. We're damaged, don't we? We're damaged. I can feel the damage already. Ten seconds of damage. That's very unfortunate. I don't want to start again. Little devil. That was a huge stutter. No, you, you're not that bad, mate. You're not that bad. I've been behind you. He was, um, yeah, not great. Right, I'm not going to pit. I'm just going to carry on. We'll drive it with 10 seconds damage. If it feels awful, then... What is with the stutters? Oh my god. Okay, last lap, here we go. What can we do with 10 seconds of damage? Break late. Yeah, I know, what are those stutters? I, I never get stutters. I don't know what it is. I'm hoping it's a server thing. It seems more like a network stutter than a hardware. Yeah, it could be. I don't normally notice stutters from people joining or leaving. A bit worrying though. I was wondering if you could see it on the stream as well, or if it was just me. You get one of those at the wrong time and that's the end of your lap. It doesn't feel too broken. Last lap, here we go. I can definitely feel the damage. Definitely, definitely. It's not turning, it doesn't turn in as, as well as it should. So my understeering Audi is a little bit more understeering. But let's see if we get any more. If it's something that keeps happening, I have to look into it. Oh my god. That's horrible. 
Do you know what caused that? ACC does have some random bugs, some random things. Sometimes I'll have low FPS for no reason. And other times it's like buttery smooth. Oh, messed that up a bit. No idea, yeah. And it only happened once. Weird things, man. Haunted software. Maybe they're little gifts that Aris left in there for us. As a little uh, parting gift. Man, this time last year, who would have thought we'd be driving around this track on this game? It was but a rumour. Right, if we don't get any traffic this time, we'll be laughing. There's a blue car up ahead. That looks like trouble already. Oh. <laughs> ah. right, I've got to watch out for this understeer. Love that corner. Always understeers there. Go. Come on. It's not a bad lap so far. Not a perfect lap. Time to lift. Just caught the dirt there. Fuck. 
finally I've added that. Oh, uh, we're just short of fuel for another. Well, it's not a 19, but it's valid. We've got damage. We'll drive until we run out of fuel. In fact, oh yeah. We've got 10 litres left. How far will that get us? Ten liters. That wouldn't even get me to work, would it? <laughs> yeah, not bad, mate. Not bad. No, to be fair, it's, it's a decent lap. It's very decent. Yeah, oh definitely. It might it's not what I was aiming for, but yeah, it's not a bad lap. It's probably my average to be fair. No more stutters yet. Well, 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 you feisty one. No one saw that. What's your best time so far, mate? What's, what have you got on the Norse Uh I know you were um, learning it, sort of, like you know it, but... What's your best so far if you've got a valid lap? Uh, I don't know if I've done this, uh, have I said this before? I recommend the Audi. Uh, really stable and predictable car. Oh nice! That's a good time man, that's not bad at all. Are you... what are you doing on Thursday? Why don't you jump into a... Uh, I know you work, I'm not sure what hours you work though. Thursday evening I'll probably do um, a Norse Life race on LFM. Yeah, big starters going on, I don't know what's going on there. Probably be a bit too early for you. No, well, yeah, it's it just takes time to get that confidence, doesn't it? It's, it's a really difficult track to uh, push all the time. There's the wall. To be honest, this track is as, it's as much about pushing, knowing when to push and when not to push. 
it is as much about not pushing it is as it is pushing. Do you know what I mean? Like, do you agree? There are just times when you don't want to be pushing and you, you shouldn't. We're going to run out of fuel, aren't we, soon? What's the time? 10.50. Driving here just eats up time, doesn't it? Seven, seven your time, okay. Uh, maybe we can do something at the weekend then. I always struggle with the carousel. I just can't seem to judge the entry and staying inside it. God, I love this section. We're going to run out of fuel now. No! We're so near the end. Ah, that's a shame. I was enjoying that. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, I did, I did think that. Like yesterday, I was racing with you on uh, Brown's Hatch with uh, Casey and the crew. Um, yeah, I get one day off in the week and a Sunday off, but Sundays I'm normally busy with my wife and kids, so it's, that's why it's so tricky to get the time on Sundays. Uh, yeah, I get one day off in the week. These stutters, man, what's going on? How many people are there? How many people? Yeah, I was really enjoying that lap. Uh, a bit gutted. Not sure whether to go again or call it a night. If I go again, it's going to get late. If I go again, it's going to get like, yeah. What was our best time? So lap three, we did 8.24.9. These QR codes are dotted all around the place, aren't they? I'm not using all. I'm not using all the track. I've got to use all the track. You have to use every inch. Look at it, though. The Audi is the best-looking car. Try the BMW. <laughs> really, that car's a tank, and it sounds like a bloody Hoover. Oh, 
I bet it, I do know it's quick here though, I know it's quick. And it's like, yeah, it must be like super stable. You know what? You know what? I will try the BMW. You've, you've given, you've planted a seed, and I'm gonna water it. I haven't tried any other car there apart from the um, Aston GT4. Uh, I'm not taking that livery because no. Uh, that's quite a nice one, I like that. That'll do. I don't have a setup though, so... What, we'll just wing it. Do you, do you know the BMW at all? <coughs> you can't tell me to drive it and then not help me with it. Whack them straight up. Um, caster, I've got to put that up. Put these uh, this side up. Um, we'll take fifty liters. Pad one. <coughs> oh, you sent me a setup. How would I get that on my on my computer? Uh, okay, one second then. I didn't know you drove the BMW. Uh, so I need to open Discord on my computer and then copy the file somewhere, I guess. Right, bear with me everyone, bear with me. <coughs> I'm just going to copy a file over into the game. Uh, messages... One... Uh, download. Right, so I've downloaded that. I don't want to download it to... The... Yeah. So I can just download that straight into the game folder, can't I? Can you guys see what I'm doing? Oh, you can. So I can just download it to... Where would it be? Nope. Or is it in documents? No. Um, setups, there we go. I did it, I did it on my own. Uh, North Life. Where would it be? Uh, uh, I haven't got a folder for it. Um, uh, wait, so if I save a setup, it will give me a folder, won't it? Uh, yeah, I'm guessing. Bear with me, bear with me. There it is. I did it. So that's 23 deg degrees. Um, okay, let's go. If you say it's good, it's good. <laughs> yeah, got it. I suck, I suck at this car, I can't drive it, it's so different to the Audi. 
Oh. Oh, there's a GT4. I doff my hat to you, sir. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Didn't need to do that. Oh, these stutters are a bit uh, persistent. I like it so far, I'm not going to lie. It feels, um, yeah, really predictable. It sort of feels like you can just push it along, you know? Don't like that window wiper. Right in the way. It feels so different to the Audi. The gearing's really short, isn't it? go. It feels good, it feels good. Oh really? Okay, with this setup, yeah. Not the Aston Martin, no. I thought you enjoyed the Aston. It feels good. It feels really nice. It goes where you point it. A nice amount of slip. It was fairly stable and predictable. Oh, but it, it does sound a bit like an angry washing machine. Let's see how long I can keep it on the track for. My first ever lap of the Nordschleife in the BMW M4. Bit more floaty, okay. <laughs> it's not too bad. I like the um, blow off valve when you downshift. Ooh. Whoa. I've kept it on the track longer than I expected, which is good. Like butter.
Oh, come on. The stutters are going to kill me, man. I hope that's nothing, uh, nothing uh, to do with my computer. I'm just trying to have a good time. Oh, nice. It feels great through there. Really good turning. I don't feel like I'm going particularly fast, but I do. I am just getting used to it still. <laughs> it's trying to bite me. I should be short shifting, shouldn't I? Actually, it's one of those cars where you don't want to hold the gear too long. Got to watch out for that bump. Ugh. Hello, Siva. I'm using a Moza R9 with a KS wheel. Ugh. Highly recommend it if you are looking for a wheel to upgrade. Of understeer there. Probably user error more than anything. Force feedback is excellent. Oh, 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 right, we didn't see that, nothing happened. The force feedback is really good, you know exactly what the car's doing. There are times in the Audi where I've just got no clue what it's doing. Like, it's just. Um, doesn't communicate exactly what's going on. Oh, flat through there. Nice. Oh, red line it, okay. Oh, I thought it was one that you short shift. We've got time for one more lap. The server's finishing. The server closes in about five minutes. We'll have time to finish the next lap. Let's have another crack. Last lap of the night. Lots of room for improvement there. 
Those stutters are not helping things, you know. I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying it more than I expected to. Shame we invalidated our lap. We probably would have got an 824 if we didn't go off. Yeah, it's I feel like I don't I don't feel like I'm hitting my pace ceiling in any car. There's definitely uh, more in me. But um, yeah, it feels really good. The amount of detail through the wheel is so much more than the Audi. I could probably do, turn the caster down a bit to be honest. The caster makes it really strong. Oh, where is he? Where is he? Oh, he's gone. Scary place to have a yellow. That was a scary feeling. But it is fun to drive around this place. <laughs> Even just driving around on your own is good fun. There are people that are out there that get to do this for a job. How is that fair? Right, I could stay in fifth for that corner, couldn't I? Deep, deep, deep. Oh no. Just about recovered it. Yeah, like being a ring taxi or something. Insane. I'd probably kill myself. In fact, I know I would. Yeah, or even doing it as a... Um, yeah, real life, like just watching them do this in real life in the 24 hours uh, is just insane. I don't know how they physically do it.
Ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. I've just got it a bit wrong, literally an inch wrong. Never mind, wasted lap. The server would have closed anyway, wouldn't it? That's the thing about this place, you just misjudge one curb and that's it, that's your lap. I think I think I can be forgiven <laughs> it being my only my second lap in the BMW. I tell you what, while well, you've given me something to think about with this car, I'm really enjoying this drive. Is it your own setup or did you get it from somewhere? Yeah, well said, it is never a waste of that. Spot on. It doesn't sound great, does it though? The Audi screams, it absolutely loves it. What happened at the end there? Like, it, we went into the dip. Uh, I always brake before the dip to try and settle it. Oh, free Dolph, okay. Are you, I do use some of his setups for the Audi. Look at this. Uh, look at this bit where we uh, go into the dip. <laughs> Let's say. Right, anyway, that's it for me tonight, man. That's it. I'm done. Uh, those stutters are annoying. I really need, need those stutters to stop. Uh, I can't. I can't be doing with that. It's, yeah, I might have to drive this a bit more. You know, the Audi's been a bit. Uh, I'm, I'm sure they changed something. I know I'm banging this drum. It's the same old drum. I feel like they changed something on the Audi with the mini patch a few days ago. And it went from a car I was 100% confident in um, to suddenly feeling a bit like wobbly on its own, on its wheels, like it was unpredictable. Uh, yeah, yeah, I really enjoyed it, mate. I'll, de I'll definitely give that another go. Um, just have to learn. Maybe I could like play an Audi soundtrack over the top and just mute the game. <laughs> Um, what was I saying? Yeah, the Audi just doesn't feel right. It's like they've broken something on it um, since the, that mini patch. Could just be placebo, but yeah, it's just uh, I'm not 100% confident in it at the moment. Uh, right, anyway, that's it. I won't take up any more of anybody's time. Uh, one, always a pleasure mate, thank you for hanging around with me um, and yeah quite a few people watching uh, Sheba is it or Sheba I'm not sure how that's pronounced exactly but um, yeah thanks for joining us on the stream I haven't seen your name before uh, give it a thumbs up and a sub and I'll see you again yeah 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 I can totally understand why you changed to this car it's, it's popular for a reason, isn't it? It's got to be. Look at the, look at this detail. This is what I love about this game. What's that in there? That's the uh, exhaust, isn't it? The downpipe. That's cool. Look at that. They know what they're doing at Kunos. What's under here then? Let us look under the car. 
make some sort of pipe work. Look at those brakes. Right, anyway, that's it. Yeah, gonna leave it there. Uh, thanks to everyone who tuned in tonight. Um, loads and loads of friendly, friendly faces really, really helped out when uh, the race went tits up. Uh, but yeah, one, thank you. And I'll be back on Thursday. Um, similar sort of time, really. Um, we'll, we'll put some laps in on the BMW on Thursday, I think. The radiator. Oh, yeah. Oh, is the radiator like in the boot? Is it laid down across the rear or something? Love the, the details are amazing. They really are. Uh, you can open the doors, can't you? Look at that. Superb. Can't you move around freely, like? There was a way to move around uh, inside the car. Oh, maybe that's in game. Uh, anyway, 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 anyway. Yeah, we could talk about these details all night, couldn't we? They're fascinating machines. Right, does look cool. Ah. Oh, hopefully I'll get a closer look at one at Brown's Hatch uh, in a couple of weeks. Um, last year you had to enter a raffle to do the pit walk to sort of get up close and personal with the teams. Uh, but this year it's, um, ac it's all access, anyone can enter uh, as long as everyone's off the grid by a certain time. So uh, yeah, that's like one of my favorite parts of race day is just getting in the pit and getting up close with the cars. Not so much the drivers. I'm not one of those people that idolizes um, drivers, but I love the machinery. Um, yeah, and the engineering. Uh, is there any new liveries? This is a new one, isn't it? Um, Beamer World. WRT are obviously all. I don't think this this one's new, isn't it? This sixth. What? This was for. Um, what race was this for? I don't recognise this livery. Probably an American livery, I'd say. Maybe GT World Challenge America. In fact, what does that say? Hey, look at that on the graphics. GT World Challenge America. <laughs> Intercontinental. I like the I like that one. That's a good one. Anyway, that's it. Calling it a night there. Uh, again. <laughs> One, take care, mate, and uh, I'll see you Thursday, hopefully. Uh, we'll do um, a race at Nordschleife, and after that, maybe something else, we'll see. So, yeah, thank you, everyone. Um, take care of yourself, uh, and I will see you in a couple of days. Happy racing. Bye.
See you later, mate. Take care.